what it do, y'all. What's up? What's up, man? Y'all come up on in here. <clears throat> come up on in here, man. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're back here for the last episode of the day, man. We are outside. It is a nice day out here. It's pretty warm, but it is what it is. You know, it's like we skip spring. There's always some. It's always a. Uh, uh, it's always a. Uh, a season that we tend to skip for some reason. There's a season that, for whatever reason, we tend to skip. Now, why it skips, I don't know. I don't know. It's just nature, God doing his thing, nature doing his thing, uh, and it's out of our control. A lot of people sit around and say, oh, man, uh, I don't like summer, man. I don't like winter, man. I don't like spring. I don't like fall. I don't like any of these things, man. Well, guess what? You get to live through it, so suck it up, huh? People let Keisha out over the goofiest things, you know. People let Keisha out over the seasons. People let Keisha out over the rain, the snow, the heat. It may be hot in the, in the, in the moment, but it is what it is. I don't know who that is. Who is that? Come on now, bro. Now my phone about to start letting Keisha out. My phone about to start letting Keisha out. I don't know who that is. I'm going to get you up out of here. Boom. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Don't care. I don't know who this is either. Uh, but what's good? What's good? Uh, come on now, bro. Come on, man. Come on, phone. Don't let Keisha out on me. Thank you. Anyways, you can't be letting Keisha out over things that have a natural course. And that's what people do. People let Keisha out over things that have a natural course. And it makes no sense. If you can't control it, why bother getting mad about it? Just let it play its course. Let it run its course. You know, the rain going to come. The heat going to come. The snow going to come. The wind going to come. It's a natural thing. Let it run its natural course. Why get mad over something you can't control? And a lot of people, oh, man, well, I was going to go do this, and now it's raining. Okay, find something else to do. Oh, man, I was going to go snowing down. I was going to go sledding down the hill, but the snow melted, man. I don't like the heat, man. Okay, go find something else to do. What's next? You know, what's next? Oh, man, I was going to go fly my kite, but the wind died down, man. I don't like it when there's no wind, man. What's next? Go find something else to do. There's always going to be something else to do. You can always find something else to do instead of sitting around and complaining about the things that you can't do, which a lot of people do, and it makes no sense. Sit here and let Keisha out over the goofiest things, the goofiest things, and you can't make it up either. Uh, but don't do things that you aren't supposed to do. You know, I've seen, I seen, and I kid you not, bro, I've seen this dude the other day when I was leaving the gym, this guy, where he was off the angel dust. And uh, I'm going to get you up out of here, bro, because you obviously won. If you don't know what a Keisha is, you are a Keisha. Uh, this guy was off the angel dust. He didn't know what he was doing. He was literally out of his mind. He had a shopping cart full of random stuff I guess that he's collected over the years whatever and uh, he was just in the middle of the road and this is a busy road I mean this is a three lane road in the middle of the road busy road uh, rush hour lunch hour whatever you want to call it and he's just walking along through the middle of the intersection just hauling his cart waving at traffic come on man come on man he's waving at traffic to come through while he's got the whole intersection stopped up you can't make the stuff up. So yeah, man, with that being said, we finna get into this last topic of the day. Um, people these days, they don't, they get sick a lot. The reason why they get sick, they don't connect with the earth. They don't go outside. They don't touch grass. They don't connect with mother nature no more because everybody wants to sit around inside, get on their phones, they want to get on the game, they want to play Fortnite, they want to play Call of Duty, they want to play World of Warcraft, whatever it is that they play, and they want to sit around and do that all day long. I'm talking to you little gamers out there who don't like to do nothing else but game. Now see, I used to be one of these people, which is why I'm speaking on it. I used to not want to do nothing but play Call of Duty. 
and none of that stuff. Uh, until all that stuff changed. The older you get, you realize you gotta do, uh, you gotta grow up. You gotta grow up eventually. And you gotta learn that it is necessary for you to connect with Mother Nature. It is necessary for you to go out there and connect with the earth. That's why I'm outside right now. It's a beautiful day outside. People would rather throw a beautiful day away to go play games instead of sitting outside, soaking up the sun, feeling the nice cool breeze that y'all guys can hear right now. People would rather throw that opportunity away to do something that is pointless and useless and has no, no profit to it at all whatsoever. Video games are like uh, substances. People get addicted to them. People think they're doing something great, something amazing. When they unlock an achievement, or they beat a boss that they've been trying to beat, or they or they, they, they advance to the next level that they haven't been able to get to yet. Or when they level up. They think they're doing the most amazing thing out there in the world. What's good, dude? They think they're doing the most amazing thing out there in the world when they do these things. Just like somebody who thinks he's doing the most amazing thing when he gets on that substance when he do that angel dust or when he do that flower it gives you a false sense of accomplishment why don't you go outside I'm going to get you up out of here why don't you go outside and actually do something for once instead of sitting around <clears throat> tricking your brain and thinking that you're doing something people need to get outside a lot more you know if we live back in the if now the people now were back in the 80s and 90s and below, they wouldn't survive. <clears throat> they didn't have very, they didn't have the amount of video games they have today, the amount of technology they have today. What's up, dude? They didn't have all the things that they have today back then. So if them people were placed in those days back then, they would all eradicate themselves off the earth by way of not knowing how to cope without the technology. Uh, they would freak out because they ain't got their phone. They ain't got the 50 inch plasma flat screen TV, uh, smart TV. They'd be freaking out if they don't have any of these types of things. <clears throat> so why don't you go outside? Maybe go take a camping trip, fishing trip, whatever the case may be. And go connect with Mother Nature again. Because that's what we were originally supposed to do. We were never originally meant to have houses. We were never originally meant to have cars none of that stuff factories buildings none of that stuff we were meant to just live on earth out in the sun the only shade that we were supposed to have were trees and rocks that's it we weren't meant to have houses we weren't meant to have huts just trees and rocks and we would eat whatever the earth would produce for us we would eat the other animals that we're meant to eat and that's it and that's all we're supposed to do is just live and, and till the ground, eat what the earth gave us, the animals that we were supposed to eat. And that's the most simplest life you could ever think of. But people today would rather live a life where they got to go to an office for working yeah, nine to five jobs. It don't make no type of Get away. I'm doing something. Move. Move. Go. My bad, y'all. I got a bunch of interruptions and stuff, but <sighs> get outside, man. Quit sitting around inside. Quit acting a fool in the video games. Quit doing things that you did as a kid, as an adult. Get now. You a grown man. You supposed to do what you supposed to do. You supposed to get outside and soak up the sun, do what you're supposed to do. We were never meant to work nine to five jobs. We were never meant to sit down in the office for eight hours a day, typing on the computer screen, soaking up all that, the, the brain waves they be uh, emitting that we're not supposed to have. We're supposed to be out here in the sun, not doing that crap. So get outside, get some vitamin D from the sun and destroy the sickness that comes within your body by sitting in the sun. Y'all don't understand the sun, it will it heal, it has a natural healing ability from any sickness that you have. It does. Y'all don't know that though because you're too busy playing video games, 
getting on your phone, tweeting, watching anime, all that other bull crap. Y'all wouldn't know that. The sun has natural healing abilities against the sicknesses on earth. Y'all wouldn't know that though. So that being said, get outside. Make sure y'all share with your friends, your families, mummies, your aunties, your grannies, and everybody else that y'all know. Ignore the background noise. There's some bull crap going on. I'm out of here, man. Deuces.